Hey everyone, uh, it's been a while since I uploaded this project for you guys where you can save Shopify contact form in Google Sheets. Uh, it's been a while, like three years ago, uh, but most recently I have been getting some queries from you guys that um, integration with Google Spreadsheet is not um, going very well. So you guys are unable to capture data within that sheet and one of the main reason is since uh, three years have been passed so lots of things have been changed uh, in google spreadsheet okay so i'm just going to create this short video so i can walk you through how you can simply uh, get google script into your sheet and make it uh, like it it capture your data okay and i will go step by step so you guys follow along okay so first thing um the main video will stay here which is already on the youtube live so this video is kind of an extension for that video okay so <clears throat> first thing you need to do is like you need to enter the field names like how it it's described in this video okay and the next thing which you need to do is you need to go to tools and then script editor and you can see it's already changed lots of things have been totally different from my last video right so all you have to do is simply go to google script.js okay you need to go to the raw you need to copy everything from here and remove what's in here and replace it just like that okay once you do that you need to save it and maybe you want to change the name of the project like shopify data capture or anything whatever you prefer okay once you do that i saw people start clicking on run directly okay but that's not what you need to do you are missing one step so first of all you need to click on this do catch and click on setup right once you do that after that you need to click on run button okay so i'm repeating this again you need to make sure follow this step exactly as i'm doing it right now okay so first click on tools and then go to script editor and within that script editor you need to replace everything what was in there already okay and then you need to click on this drop down button default value is do get selected but you need to switch it to setup then you need to click on run it will ask you for the permissions which you need to grant and i will do it review permissions and you need to choose the account where this file is loaded click on advanced and go to shopify data capture unsafe option there is no other option you have to do that okay once it's done you need to click on allow so that's done exactly how we wanted it to be okay the next step will be you need to click on deploy and you need to click on new deployment right and here um, it's going to give you some instruction please select a deployment type you need to choose like click on this gear icon and then you need to choose web app when you do that you can add some description like shopify capture like this okay then you need to choose anyone uh, before that uh, it was saying something else but from now on you need to choose uh, the third option which is anyone okay not with uh, anyone with google account okay so just anyone okay once you do that you need to click on deploy and there you go so that's the url you are going to use in your project okay like how you were going to use it in this main youtube video which is already live okay so just make sure you follow these steps and that's how you set up the script on your google 
spreadsheet you can use this url in your project to capture the data that's it that's how you can set up this google spreadsheet script in 2021 okay thank you so much guys have a nice day bye